Hey guys, Baraka1994 here, bringing you another commentary. Um, this gameplay I actually do well for me. Um, it's Domination on Rust, and it, the gameplay is laggy. That's because um, I was visiting a college at this point, and I was trying to piggyback off their guest Wi-Fi, which is really bad, but I actually end up doing really well. Um, most of the game I'm using the spaz just because I was actually trying to get clips instead of a gameplay, but I ended up getting a pretty nice gameplay. Um, so in this commentary, it's ac I actually am not doing kind of a regular topic commentary. It's kind of like a reaction commentary. Um, I don't know how many of you saw the video Optic Midnight put up a while ago. Um, telling us all that she um, likes both the male and female sex. I wouldn't call her gay because, well, gay or lesbian or anything like that because that's not really right to do. But um, she's just into both um, male and female. So I'm just kind of uh, making a video to of my um, reactions and thoughts about that, and. Uh, my first initial thought was, wow, I didn't see that coming. Um, yeah, uh, I never saw that coming from her. Um, but apparently she's like that. And um, that's fine. We all make our own choices and we're all allowed to make our own choices. And that's a personal decision. It's not mine to influence or anything. Um, even though, yeah, I don't exactly agree with it. I don't think that's right, but that is my personal, um, that's what I think, and she's free to think what she thinks, and I'm free to think what I think. It's the beauty of living in a country where you're free to think whatever you want to think. Um, but kind of like my response to her in a way is, um, good for you. Uh, it's amazing you had the courage to go out and tell everyone that. And I, I mean, I know that it all kind of started off from, I think it was like Twitter or something. So I don't know if Midnight felt obligated to do that, but still, I mean, it takes a whole lot of courage to go out and say something that isn't, quote, normal. Um, so yeah, that takes a lot of courage and good job. At midnight, I mean, I don't know if I could do that, but then again, I don't really have anything to uh, say that isn't exactly normal. <laughs> um, but also, like, oh, what was I going to say? I know that um, her circumstances are probably different than mine. I mean, I'm still in high school, and she's, I think she's out of college, I don't know if she went to college or not, but, um, I mean, her circumstances are definitely different, but, I mean, still, she had to have the courage to say all that, and, I mean, with that could come a lot of stuff, like, people might unsubscribe to her just because they found out that she likes girls basically, which that isn't exactly seen as, as a positive for a lot of people, but then for other people, they don't really care. Um, so, I mean, it is kind of a, quote, crazy thing to do, but she did it, and yeah. So, kudos to you, Midnight. Um, I don't think I could have ever said something like that if that was me, but good job for you, and eh, it would be cool if you watched this video, but I highly doubt you would, but if you do, leave a thumbs up. Anyway, um, so that was my midnight reaction thing there, and um, don't really have another topic other than, sorry guys, I've been kind of, um, oh, what's the word, inactive lately. Um, I've been really, really, really busy with school, and I know I made a quick video about this the other day, but I've been really busy with school. It's my senior year. I have to get good grades. Um, 
and I haven't really had much time. And along with work, I started my job finally uh, Tuesday. And I was working for, I think it was like four hours. Um, so that day I basically finished school, went off to work, and then came home, ate dinner, and went to bed. Um, but hopefully I'll be producing more videos. As I've said before, I have multiple videos that I have to upload. I'm actually rendering one out now that hopefully I'll be uploading this week. Um, I plan to become less act inactive. Um, I have a Minecraft series I want to start up. Um, my own little thing. Uh, I, I don't know. You guys want me to start my Quest for a Triple episodes up again? I've kind of stopped doing them. Um, also what kinds of gameplays do you guys want to see? Um, I have an Assault Cube Special Edition gameplay that um, is kind of in the raw stages right now. I don't have anything hooked up with it. That'll be saved for a later commentary. Um, and I can get more footage from that. The guy I um, did the Minecraft with the other day, we're hoping to get together again and record more Minecraft. Um, we both really, really enjoyed that. Um, what we actually hope to do together is start a little Minecraft channel. I'll let you know if that actually happens. His channel, um, I won't put it in the description of this video, I'll do it in the Minecraft video, but his channel's only Minecraft. Um, so, I mean, if you like Minecraft and you like the video we did together, go subscribe to him. Um, he's only put up one video so far, but I know he's planning more, so don't worry about that. Uh, let's see. I think that's about it for updates. Um, so tell me what you guys want to see. Um, also, if you want to see more videos or more games. Um, I also am currently editing a montage for one guy. And then another guy, a different guy is trying to get me clips. So soon I'll be working on two montages. And you can see the lag right there. And I don't know how that didn't hit up. But you'll see um, those come out soon. And I'm editing them in Vegas. So hopefully they turn out okay. Um, I think they will. But who knows. Um, let's see. I think that's about all I wanted to say. I've still got two minutes left. So, um... I guess I'll talk about school. In school this year, I've been, or I've been, for those of you who don't know, I'm doing cyber school this year, which basically um, is a lot of fun. I, I'm enjoying it a lot. And uh, there's two different types of classes you can take through my cyber school, virtual classes and um, self-paced classes. The self-paced classes are kind of what they say, self-paced. Whereas you do, where um, you uh, basically you're assigned however much work you have to do in the whole year, and then um, you're kind of on your own for how long it takes you and stuff. Um, and then there's uh, virtual classes, which um, you go into this like room type thing. And you actually, there's like a teacher talking to you. It's kind of like a web chat without a webcam. Um, there's teachers talking to you and they're teaching you the curriculum and all that. And it, it's honestly a lot of fun. Um, probably my favorite class has to be sports media and broadcasting. The teacher is amazing. He's like so like awesome. He gets, he, <laughs> there's times where he starts screaming basically because he, he's so passionate. Um, so it's, it, it's really cool to have a teacher who's that passionate about something. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's, it's pretty awesome. My other classes, uh, I don't really, I don't really, I can't say much about my other classes just because, I mean, they're not my favorite, but 
I really like my Photoshop class too. Which that was nice because they basically what they did is they sent me the Photoshop disc in the mail. Which was pretty awesome. So I'll probably eventually be putting that on my personal computer. Um, oh, and another thing. The other day I was playing Modern Warfare 3. Or Modern Warfare 2. Not 3. 3 is not out yet. At my friend's house who I was recording Minecraft with. And literally I had a spaz triple but wasn't recording because I wasn't trying to do anything. So I was like FML right there. That sucks. So I was all bummed out. Because I am going to be making a montage of my own soon, guys. So stay tuned for that. Um, I don't know if it's going to be a mixed game montage or if it's just going to be Modern Warfare 2. But anyway, out of time. So if you like the video, please rate, comment, and subscribe. It would be greatly appreciated. Peace.